Hi everyone, in this series we will make this data visualizer app in TV. So this is the interface of our application and as you can see first of all user need to select files for visualization. So let's click on this button and this will open our file chooser menu. So just go to the directory where you have your files and there I have these three files shop1, shop2 and shop3. So user can select a single file or he can select multiple files as well. Like for example, if I want to visualize this shop1 and shop2 data, so just select these two files and open them. After opening these files, user need to click on this button. So let's click it. And as you can see, this is our data visualizer man interface. So these are the files which user has selected and we will create this whole control panel dynamically. Our system is basically reading the file names and then uh, the properties and the column data which are present in these files names in real time if you select a different excel files with different properties then you will see those properties right here not these ones so we will create this thing dynamically so let's suppose i want to visualize this shop one data and then i just want to visualize a gpu against that and after selecting these things user need to click on this update button and yeah as you can see this is our graph and now for example if i want to visualize this shop 2 data as well and then the cpu and then mouse and click on this update now as you can see we are basically visualizing these two files simultaneously and now let's suppose if i deselect this shop 1 and if i click on this update now we have only shop 2 data and now let's visualize this case as well and update it and now as you can see we are actually visualizing these four properties and after doing everything else user can save this graph as well. like for example just update it and now let's click on this save button and here the user need to select that directory where he want to save the figure so let's suppose he want to save the figure in hello folder and just select that folder and click ok and this will save your file and in order to confirm whether it has saved it successfully or not just go to the directory hello and let's open this directory and yeah as you can see here we have our this figure so i hope you will enjoy making this application and i will see you in the next tutorial till that point bye bye